a unique temple dedicated to an intriguing set of deities in the city of temples, Bhuvaneshwar. The Chausat Yogini Temple at Hirapur is really one of a kind. The Chausat Yogini Temple or the Temple of the 64 uh, Tantric Goddesses is one of the most famous Tantric temples uh, in the state of Odisha, in fact anywhere in uh, the country. It is amazing that in 1953 this was just a, a private reserve or a private spiritual uh, uh, temple for the local villagers over here. It was only in 1953 that the head of the museums in Bhuvaneshwar actually identified this temple and brought it in the public eye. It is an amazing piece of architecture from the 9th century CE. A well-kept secret for many centuries, you wouldn't have seen a temple like this anywhere in India. Low and open to the sky, the temple was built by Queen Hira Devi of the Brahma dynasty that ruled here during the 9th century CE. Dedicated to the Tantric mother goddesses, experts believe that these could have been the old forest spirits who were later incorporated into the Hindu pantheon. It's important to know that this temple is older than the more famous Konar or Jagannath temples in the state of Odisha. At the temple, the priest gave us a guided tour telling us about the 63 goddesses who reside here. One sculpture is missing. 26-year-old Pankaj Padi's family has served this temple for generations. Daily worship here starts at the break of dawn before 4.30 every morning. मंदिर सुबह 4 से 4:30 तक मैंने खुला होता है उसके बाद मां जी का स्नान होता है चौषुड़ जोगिनी का जो पानी और हल्दी पाउडर और जो कोकोनट का पानी से स्नान होता है उसके बाद आलती होता है उसके बाद कोकोनट और फ्रूट्स भोग होता है एक से 1:30 बजे राइस और दाल भोग होता है और शाम को आलती होकर बंद होता है ये एवरीडे का सिस्टम and uh, one year I have two times the Navratra Maka to main puja ek dasara hota hai aur ek Ram Navam ke sama. This Yogini temple is a celebration of the goddess or Shakti in the tantric form. Feared by mainstream Hinduism, there is still a lot of mystery shrouding tantric worship. Pankaj explains the pantheon of Yoginis residing in this temple. दस महाविद्या मतलब मां काली जी है तारा बगला मुखी धुमावती मातंगी भुवनेश्वरी सोडोसी कमला धुमावती छिन्नमस्त का ये है और नवदुर्गा है शैलपुत्री ब्रह्मचारिणी चंद्रघंटा कुष्मांडा स्कंदमाता ये सब नवदुर्गा भी है the 64 yoginis enshrined in this temple, according to the Chandi Purana, were formed from the different parts of the Devi or goddess's body. Arranged in a circle, in a circular temple, open to the sky, this temple is also full of symbolism. The circle represents the sun, the eye, time and even eternity. The circle or the chakra plays an important part in tantric worship. In fact, this shape is unique to tantric yogini temples like this one in Hirapur. As we wound down the trip to Hirapur, it was also time to bow our heads, pray and hear the chants that have been heard here for over 1200 years. The Hirapur Yogini Temple is a rare gem from the distant past. The fact that so many throng here is also an iteration of how the devoted have found peace here through generations. <laughs>